Okay, so what are we doing this morning? This cold morning. Well, it's not even that cold, but it's early. <laughs> uh, we're getting ready to leave for Bus by the Bridge. We got my my uh, 65 double cap with puck ready. Yeah. Then we have Mitch with his 66 Deluxe and his little trailer, camping trailer. So we all ready to go, Mitch and the girls. And then we have the egg bus ready to go. Jeff is going to be the pilot of the uh, egg bus. And of course, Bruce and Wayne, they will be joining us to buses by the bridge. Oh yeah, they're anxious to get there. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Jeff is still getting ready with the, the camera since he's gonna be recording uh, the trip for the weekly episodes. Right. We'll keep you guys updated as we uh, as we roll out for this uh, epic adventure once again to Arizona. So it seems like we're uh, the first one to arrive at what is hopefully the uh, <laughs> the meeting uh, uh, place. It's already 5.30, we got, actually got here like five minutes late. Hope they didn't leave us. <laughs> uh, so we're gonna try to contact the rest of the group and let's see if they, uh, they're coming or what. Uh, heard Jeff who's struggling with the dogs. <laughs> they're freaking out. They're not used to this kind of, a, they're not used to this kind of activity. <laughs> You should bring his uh, cages. They probably feel secure in their cages. What? Really? No, relax. You gotta relax, boy. You gotta relax. No, sit. All right. So, hey, you made it. All right. You too! You made it! How you doing this morning? We got up at first! I was like, I barely woke it up. Yeah? I'm trying to go back to sleep. You will. So I don't know. We either too, uh, too early or too late. <laughs> Alright. Well, let's see. I already messaged... Uh, uh, the guys so hopefully they uh they respond pretty soon otherwise uh we're gonna keep pushing try to make the habits by by noon all right so everybody showed up and we're just topping off with gas so we could uh take off and uh so everybody's here we're doing great time it's not that far. So this is gonna be our group, and then uh, Mitch is over there. McDonald's just getting some, getting some breakfast, some quick breakfast. So it's gonna be a pretty good group. Hopefully, no breakdowns this time. Uh, it's a little bit windy. I mean, my truck is probably the slowest. I mean, the the heaviest of of them all. But uh, probably gonna take the uh, tail this time. So uh, on like little hills and stuff, everybody could go, and then I'll make it. You know, I'm slowly but surely. Uh, I'll make it. All right, so we're gonna finish up, and then we're gonna be uh, taking off uh, in a, just a few minutes here. All right, so we did a little pit stop. Right before we head to Parker, we have a pretty cool, pretty cool lineup of buses here. The egg bus, the uh, Mitch's bus, the egg bus, crew cap, 
This is uh, Jose taking a leak right there. <laughs> Oh yeah. Alright, yeah, we had to put a nice view. Oh. Oh, okay, I didn't get that. Can you repeat that? Can you do it again? Do it again, I didn't get it on video. Do it again! I didn't get it on video! Well, that's the line up right here. Had just took a little break before get, heading to Parker, Arizona. So what do you know? The egg bus made it to buses by the bridge without any breakdowns or problems. How boring, how boring. Yeah, the uh, egg bus uh, run it real good uh, against the wind. It was pretty windy at some areas and some big hills, but made it pretty good. Also, uh, uh, Bruce and Wayne, they they barely made it. They barely made it. They were all like crying and are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Finally made it. So we're setting up camp right now. Uh, Mitch already has his spot, and um, I have my spot here with the puck. So uh, it's a little windy. Hopefully the wind is gonna go away. And if not, well, who cares? So this is the way we're setting up right here. This is the this is the BTO area uh, called the Danger Zone. I don't know why. Um, and Mitch is gonna set up right here, He's setting up his his tent. Oh, look at that! That was quick. Yeah, that was quick. We can easily. Oh. Mitch is quick and easy. Yeah, yes. Mitch, you need to like this. <laughs> oh, okay. He knows what he's doing, in other words. Uh, buck off, please. Sir. Then we got the Mitch's setup right here, and then this is where the egg glass is gonna, it's gonna sit. This is where it's gonna happen. All right, so we're gonna get situated. And then we're gonna start start thinking on food and booze and lose woman. I mean, no, no, no. Nah. They've been having fun since what? Since two weeks? Two weeks ago? All right. These guys know how to party. This guy's no how to party. Oh, they're selling something. Some something legal here. I don't know what it is. And here's the birthday girl. Look at her, she looks all grown up now. <laughs> so it's time for Pozole. Look at this. Pozole con pata y espinazo that my mom made for the video uh, crew. Look at that. It's ready to go. Come on. Come and get it. Mitch is making a quesadillas over here. Yeah. Chef. Uh, uh, uh.
making of the fire who passes by the bridge yeah come on baby light my fire Bruce and Wayne they are crying for his daddy they have a big pile of wood hopefully we're gonna go through it it's actually getting cold now and the fire is lit over there that's a stand oh, yeah. and pro uh check and that's even larger what you see right here is a bunch of cornish hens is they like running they're like coming towards us somewhat and they think we probably have a beautiful view. But there is a, a probably 20 right here. They just they came across the street. Son colornices. You can see put a la plumita arriba en la cabeza. They're pretty good size too. Where's my shotgun? Man, I could not done 20 in one. In one shot. <laughs> They're actually beautiful. They're actually quite beautiful. What do you think? Uh, Cornish hands. Uh, in Espanol, codornices. Or perniz. Mm -mm. Only in Arizona. Alright, so this was this ended up being our setup right here. Right now we're closed for business because we're gonna go walk and uh, take some pictures and uh, talk to some people on the show. So uh, gonna enjoy ourselves. Then later on we come back and we cut some more keys. This is uh, Tony's bus right here, BTO Tony, Tony Posada, and then we have uh, Steve, Steve's and Larky set up over here. So we're gonna go and uh, talk to some people, have fun, enjoy the show. This is uh, Glenn, Glenn Borhoff, uh, extended, extended bed, extended cap, uh, single cap, a white bed, that's actually a white bed, single cap. He bought these at Pomona from uh, George. George over there from Big Bear. Yeah, we were there for one when he bought it. He just he drove it home. Now he's here and passes by the bridge. It's a pretty nice single cap. It's early. Lots of lots of cool buses. A lot of trailers. Obviously, a lot of camping stuff. This guy's doing a horseshoe. Caesar and so single cap. Nice single cap. And uh, and also this is his uh, his setup right here. How you doing? This is Lou Caesar right here on his. What year is your car? 
and why do you drive it and why do you what is what is some, uh, something that you love about this car why Drink and drive? No, I don't know about that. Uh, cut, cut, cut. He's driving. Uh, uh, he's got a little matching trailer over here. And this car, he's cheating because he's got like uh, uh, these brakes and uh, probably like a, a Chevy motor. No, you have a big motor, right? I mean, what? Cruise control for me. I can't even see your face. People are not gonna be able to see yeah, you. Look right here, come inside. Look right there's cruise control. See it? Really? The gray underneath the light switch. Oh my goodness. Yeah, you told me about that yeah. cruise control thing. Yeah. yeah. I didn't want to believe you, but well, I guess you. Know, I guess you do. Are you gonna be playing tonight? I don't know. We'll see. You're we'll thinking about it? Yeah. See? Depends how drunk you guys are, or what? After the after the anything. Yes. yes. All right, good, good. Well, excellent. This gonna be on TV? On YouTube, yeah. So make sure that you sign up to my YouTube channel. Oh, I did, I know. Yeah. Yes. Follow our adventures, you know. So we're gonna try to get as many, many, hey, many guys. Hey, that window frame. Yes. Keep it. Okay. Keep it. And watch. Next week it's sold for 150. <laughs> let's see. Let's see. Maybe. No, keep it. All right. All right. Well, we're gonna. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right, we gotta talk to more guys. This is Mona's uh, Bob and Mona bowling uh, double cap. Finally done. It's beautiful. Came out really nice. It's turkeys. I know. Pin striping. Wow, they did a good job on this one. Alright, let's see it. Let's see. This is Team Barani's. <laughs> yes, that, that would not be good. That would not be good. This is uh, Team Barani's 57 uh, combi. Takes uh, a lot of pride. Maybe turn on the key. That will, that will work also. Got a, got a nice display right here. Of uh, stuff that he uses. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. With a six volt electrical system in the winter time when it's 30 below zero, your battery goes flat. A beetle can push down the road. The bus is too heavy. So they clean up the camper. Look at it. So smooth. And the glass coil. <laughs> Never seen one. Never seen one before. Another uh, really interesting thing about this bus, it's uh, this uh, snowflake type of uh, bubbling that the windows have. 
is it seems like they've done on purpose but they not they just that's that was a natural occurrence right there never seen something like that this exactly like a snowflake look at this pretty cool Very nice. Hey, ain't no Mexicans allowed over here. Get out of here. We Mexican. We just, we just look Mexican. Oh, we're not Mexican. This is Louis. This is Louis Macias. Hey. Well, he's, 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 he's Ruiz, but me. I'm his other lover. Que paso loco. What's up? Just good? checking out. Hey. Yeah. Right, Having fun. I followed him all over here with this thing. <laughs> oh, yeah? What is it? <laughs> all right. So now it's my 65 crew cap, the one that needed some, uh, need some wrench in here before we go tomorrow, before we go back to uh, California. Uh, I was hearing some knocking, uh, seems like um, I lost a little bit of power on the way over here too. And when I opened my valve cover, I noticed that one of the nuts um well this of the head studs came out it was actually completely out so no wonder um, i was feeling uh a uh, last little power there so hopefully i should be able to torque it I, I'm, I'm afraid the stud is gonna be it's gonna come out so i'm gonna try to torque the head and hopefully i'm gonna be able to do it um Worst case scenario, I mean, we're not going that far, so I mean, it goes, but in the hills, I could just feel the uh, loss of power. And I'm pretty heavy, I'm pulling the puck on the, on, the, uh, on the bus. So hopefully we should be able to repair this one and then get home. This engine's retired, so uh, if he takes me back home, I'm gonna be happy. All right, keep you guys updated on these.
Oh, I can't help quoting you Cause everything that you say brings true Oh, 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 oh. And now we must tell our story And here's a list of what I, I kinda I kinda actually like him singing though. Well he's not oh, okay. When he gets drunk, what are you doing, Gabby? The first thing to go is his oh, yeah. It's kind of oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I can see you just fine, brother. I can see you just fine. <laughs> Handsome stardom, and these are the ways on which I was raised. These are the ways on which I was, which I was raised. I never wanted to kill. I am not naturally evil. The things I do just to make myself more attractive to you. How you doing, man? Don, Dave, Manny, they connected somehow. Sister, I'm up all over this Okay, Danny, so what is that? It tell us what is that all about? Limey, the best in the world. Denise. Who makes them? Denise Howard. Denise Howard. A bus is by the bridge. Three years for this. Three years. Why do you have to wait three years? She's been making them every year. She wasn't Eight o'clock in the morning and then eleven o'clock again. I'm always late. And what is it? When we get back, we need to clean up. Well, we have uh, a lip. 
Johnny even, garlic. Johnny even told you the secret recipe. Asparagus. That's asparagus. Yep. And a blowing Mary. Celery. Yeah, it's it's good. Pickle. Shoot up lemon. Yep. And it's a good one. Oh yeah. Real. Yep. The thing is raging alcoholic. <laughs> it's early eight o'clock in the morning. <laughs> All right. Enjoy. Right. So this is a uh, BTO camp camping site, and this is uh, it's time to pick up. So uh, this uh, this one bus had engine problems. Actually, the engine is still off. Seems like uh, this one is gonna, it's gonna need to be towed back home. But it's okay. We came as a group. We're gonna leave as a group. This one is also having issues. We had uh, engine problems uh, and right now it's running but it's not charging so I think generator is bad but we could run it as long as the, it doesn't turn on the lights should be fine This is Henry's motor so obviously it's not gonna go, it's not going anywhere <laughs> It's gonna go in the back of the bus Stand, ready to go. Bus slow up, trailer. And Steve, Steve Black, they're ready to go. Anthony, picking up, picking up. And uh, the 11 is, I mean, uh, uh, raffles are starting right now. We're about tickets. Go ahead. So, this is Mitch's. And my bus is also having a little trouble. But we're hoping that we're going to get it going. Hoping anyways. But anyways, yeah, we'll get home somehow. Somehow. So. Uh, well, it's your bus, so. I'm sure you, you had breakfast, right? You did. So, everybody's speaking up. The egg bus did pretty good. Hopefully. We're not gonna have any trouble on the way back. I was actually thinking of taking my uh, puck and uh, connecting it to the uh, egg bus so, so I could take some weight off. Um, and that way uh, I could help the engine, at least by not being that heavy. But. Uh, we're, uh, we're gonna see, we're gonna start this thing up pretty soon. I think I'm just gonna, gonna adjust the valves and uh, hopefully uh, it's gonna respond good. Well, even if it's not, I mean, I, I, it's probably gonna run shitty, but it will make it home. Raffle's about to start, so everybody's over there trying to get the motor. Hopefully Danny will bring the motor. She's, she needs one. For uh, her new bus. They were working on stitch bus earlier. Probably they were just probably doing a time or something. They were timing it. So hopefully it's also running good. Nice, 
nice barn door set up. Two barn doors. Johnny, a minute. channel Jack was just here relaxing with his dogs, waiting to go home. Woo -hoo. All right. Well, all good. All good things must come to an end. So let's wrap it up. Let's see. Uh, let's see who's who <laughs> with the cars. All right. We'll keep you posted on our adventure getting back home. All right. So managed to uh, put the. Um, Tied the uh, head as much as I could. One of the studs at least probably took 12 or 13 pounds of pressure. Uh, I started it right up. Sounds good. Sounds somewhat good. So I think we're just gonna take it easy, go slow, and maybe check, you know, stop and check somewhere, see if we need to retie that uh, that one stud. So hopefully we make it home. Um, pretty heavy you know I'm pulling the puck and all my stuff all my equipment so we're just gonna take it easy just gonna go take the back roads and uh, uh, there's a big it's a caravan it's a group so hopefully we're not gonna leave nobody behind I'm not the only ones uh, with, with problems fortunately the egg buzz is doing pretty good and it's not gonna struggle so but uh, uh, Let's see how it goes. Um, we'll post if we have any problems. But so far, so good. You could hear it. I could hear it a little bit, but. So that's as good as it's gonna get, I guess. Just go slow. All right. We'll keep you guys updated. <laughs> And this is it. This was bus by the bridge. Everybody's pretty much packed up, and ready to hit the road. Now uh, we're gonna make sure that everybody's uh, ready to roll, and uh, and then we're gonna take we're gonna take off. Well, Henry Louis got a a ride back home. <laughs> He's gonna be faster than than we are. He's actually gonna beat us. <laughs> All right, that's great. That's actually Eric, Octoman. Uh, happened to have a trailer, empty trailer, so they're gone. They're done. All right, everybody else still loading up. Just making sure that everything, the last minute preparations. <laughs> They're ready to go. They're ready to go. What's up, man? Got oil? Perfect the mundo. Nice. Alright, seems like we're ready to roll. We got a big caravan. BTOs and friends ready, ready to hit the road. Let's see. Two buses now giving us trouble. So hopefully uh, we'll make it home safe. Safe and safe and sound. Checking the lights on that one. 
check it out the electrical, so it's working fine. Let's see how mine does. Break down, right? We're gonna go straight, no problems. That's what we're hoping. Anyways, sounds good. It doesn't sound like it's knocking right now. So we'll just uh, maybe halfway we stop, take the bulb cover out, check, maybe retie it or whatever. We'll make it. All right, we're rolling. Let's go. So far so good, we made it to Parker. Uh, my truck run pretty good. Um, you know, slow on the hills, but uh, at least it's not knocking. So I think it's holding, the torque uh, of the head is holding. Uh, I'm still gonna check when we stop over there to fuel, to refuel, uh, I'm gonna stop and check just in, just in case, but it's running good. So we shouldn't have no problems. I mean, we're gonna hit a few hills, but it's, uh, it's running good, so. I'm happy about that, so I haven't slowed down the group. But we just uh, we stop back here. We stay. We stop here in Parker to uh, eat and to refuel, and then we're gonna be on our way. We saw this uh, this truck pulling this trailer. Uh, pretty nice, nice logo on the side of the uh, of the trailer here. Lundis Peoria Volkswagen. Uh, it's got a bus. It's got a nice deluxe bus. Uh, and then a beetle and then the other side is, it has a concept uh, one of those new beetles kind of nice <laughs> all right we're gonna have lunch let's do lunch the bruce and wayne what are they gonna eat crazy dogs they're gonna eat they're gonna eat crumbs What are you gonna eat? Nobody's giving me anything. <laughs> you pass me over and you're like, quick thinking. I thought you just wanted to get away. Like, you know what? You're too slow. I'm just gonna go in front of you. Because <laughs> it, like, it, it looked like it was going low from the time I first saw it. And I was like, oh my god, get over the first time. <laughs> nah, good thinking. Thank you. Thank you. Well, I got a uh, a flat tire it just basically deflated as we were going up a little hill and thanks to the quick thinking of Christine she just told me to pull over and we did it wasn't it wasn't very safe to to uh, park on the side but uh, it was safe enough it was it was safe enough and I put my spare tire and of course it's a little uh, low on air but um, Anthony had a nice compressor here, air compressor. Hooks up to the battery. Perfect. And uh, we should be able to be rolling in a little bit. Excellent. Woo! So we all, we all stopped right here. There's about 10 buses. And then a little beetle. So we are uh, just on the border of uh, Arizona and California. And we just stopped to regroup, make sure that everybody is uh, it's okay. So far, I think just my, my blown tire is the only thing that it's uh, holding us right here. As soon as we put air, we're just gonna be able to okay, hit, start heading back again. Oh wow, there's a bunch of cars. We're taking over this whole section.
<laughs> what? Always an adventure. Always an adventure. When we're driving all these old, old buses. Tommy! What's up? Yeah, flat tire. Ah, oh, getting, getting it handled. Pretty weird colors in the sky. What is that? And it's always right next to the sun. The other time was pretty similar. I have a similar picture. Just to report that my bus is still pushing. We we haven't even uh, rechecked the, the head. Right now we're heading towards uh, Churiaco Summit, and bus has been able to maintain uh, 55, 60 uh, speeds. And I'm still pulling my puck, so uh, I'm happy. I think uh, once we get up to the mountain, uh, we're gonna go down to Indio, and then from there we're pretty much home. So wish us luck. We're gonna catch up with the uh, rest of the the caravan. It's probably waiting for us right there to refuel at uh, Chiriaco Summit uh, gas station. It's a beautiful afternoon, and the buses are still rolling. It's a good day. It's a good day to be driving a BW bus. Well, <laughs> it happens. You know, we drive BW, so you know. From Jerome, the egg bus. See, look, the egg bus is running. Now, my is the one that gave us a little trouble. But Jerome is a uh, uh, Jeremy's a lifesaver, man. He, he he drove us all the way from Jerome. You know, he was. He was gonna buy a bus in Prescott and that cell fell through. So, you know, so like, oh, I could just bring you, take you from that now. And he took us all the way to Banny. <laughs> how, how, how long you been here? Damn. How do you, how got a hold of him? He just, you, he saw you or? Okay. Cool, cool, cool. That's awesome. Well, Jeremy come through again for one of our buses. Thanks a lot, brother. You're a lifesaver. We wish you would drive a BW bus, but we're glad you don't because you always bring in this trailer <laughs> and always uh, get us out of trouble, man. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Really appreciate that. So Jeremy actually went to the show, and then uh, he had actually had to go home and unload all his stuff, and then come back with an empty trailer here, uh, Churiaco Summit, to pick up uh, Johnny Johnny Jimenez uh, barn door bus. That uh, unfortunately, I think the engine seized on it. Oh, engine blown on a barn door is never fun. So he's been probably here about three hours, just you know, just waiting for. For uh, somebody to rescue him, and yeah, Jeremy came through for him again. Uh, last <laughs> last year in September, he uh, uh, he towed our egg bus from Jerome all the way to Jerome to uh, Banning. So that man, what a lifesaver! He he, he uh, helped us a lot. That was awesome. And now he's gonna help uh, Johnny take his uh, bus home. I saw those guys in three bay windows, right? Three. They were sitting there, they had their chairs and everything. Did you see the guys that were on the stupid boat? <laughs> drinking beer! They're drinking beer and like, I go like, maybe they're casting, they're fishing, maybe they're casting. <laughs> A pontoon boat. Some motherfuckers were up on top of the boat just chilling. And just saying bye to us, you know? I haunted them on the way, I was like, hey, what's up, you know, right? I was leaving back. And then they were just like looking at all the fucking. Buses go by and Dude, let you have us that way. You know? <laughs> You're missing something. Oh yeah, water. <laughs> they were drinking beer, so they're they're all good. It's all good, you know. Yeah. Uh, I, uh, Christine kept going because of yeah, the light, she went down and then but she went didn't she needed to refuel? I mean, did she refuel? I know, but she's she needed fuel as well. There's no more. There's. Gas and 30, 30 more miles, so 
Otherwise, I have a gallon there with gas, so. All right, I guess. Jeremy, because I'm going to grab something out of it. We're going to start head going. It's going to start heading back. It's dark already. <laughs> All right, so how many buses do we have here? How many over there still? Uh, Stitch, you know. Uh, Stitch says he rescued a woman with, oh, she got a fuel and over her face and. That's why the restroom is He had to carry her to the restroom, you know, so. He took her to the So they could, you know, wash her face because she got all fuel. I mean, how do you get gasoline in your face pumping? He's like, oh, is this thing on? Oh, oh. How do you do that? I mean, <laughs> all right, guys. Well, hey, it's all part of the adventure of driving a BW, you know. And uh, I, uh, Henry Lewis, also his bus yeah, went, yeah. went went on, on a trailer. All right. Well, we're gonna keep we're gonna keep rolling. Well. Seems like we made it home. Getting up from Archibald up to 10. And also, here is where we say goodbye to Mitch. They're, they're gonna keep going to Pasadena. It was, uh, my truck made it, so we're so happy about that. Despite all the uh, little problems we're having with it. Uh, it, uh, it decided to take me all the way home this, this one last time before we actually service this, this, this motor. So we're pretty happy about that. Uh, Woohoo! Almost home. Oh, thank God we are home. We got back safely to uh, Rancho Cucamonga. My truck's still running. And he behaved like a true champion. In spite of a loose head, <laughs> it actually made it. Uh, we're over here at Jehu's place, and then uh, the egg bus run great. I mean, that was uh, the least of our worries. It actually run it really strong, and uh, we never had any problems with it. Uh, so uh, we're gonna conclude this uh, video. We couldn't, uh, we couldn't cover everything about Bus by the Bridge. I mean, there's so much more that we could have covered the Cornhorn uh, Tournament, and there's so many vendors and so many friends that we could have talked talk to and interview and stuff, but we just did not have enough time. Uh, it just went so quickly. It was definitely the uh, biggest of uh, Bus by the Bridge. We heard that there was 401 buses uh, register so this has got to be the uh, the biggest of, of, of the, of the uh, buses by the bridge uh, number 18 we're hoping that next year it's even gonna be even better uh, we had a lot of fun we met a lot of friends and we cut a few keys and sold a few things uh, we also bought some stuff from Swami so uh, until next year <laughs> and until our, our next adventure so please make sure that you uh, uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel so you could uh, keep seeing the updates and little videos that we uh, put together for you and your enjoyment and also I mean some of you are gonna see yourselves on some of those videos so make sure that you like the uh, videos and comment on them also click on some of those annoying ads <laughs> kind of help us when you do uh, thanks a lot for your support and until our next BW adventure we're signing out here it was uh, this BBT uh, bus by the bridge um, trip was a success